Hey there, Slim Boom, and I just want to do a little crappy recording here letting you guys know this match happened after my last Black Ops 3 livecom, the video where I was getting dunked on by the Banshee shotgun. So that this happens directly after that match. Same recording session. So if you guys don't know where that is, it's uh, it's a video. I'll, I'll link it down below in the description. I'll put an annotation on the screen. I'll put it in the comments. It'll be somewhere. Uh, or you guys have already seen it. Uh, either way, guys, I hope you guys enjoy watching and uh, have some fun. All right, so now we're up on the rematch. I, I don't know how many people are still in here. It, it says there's 3v3 that could change. I just wanted to keep recording because I'm having fun. So if this video is uploaded days later after the first match, you guys will be able to notice that I'm still wearing the same shirt. I'm going to use the Razorback. You know what? Actually, I'm going to snipe from the beginning. I'm really bad at sniping in Black Ops 3. I was okay during launch, but then I just stopped doing it, and I got really, really bad. So check my volume levels here so I'm not being too loud in your guys' ear. Okay. Fucking please, 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 please. Do it, do it, do it. Oh, see? Like, I'm... Mm, I'm so bad. I guess that's the thing about Black Ops 3 that I don't... That's actually really good. I mean, a lot of you guys that might not play Call of Duty think, Oh, the game's just a bunch of jumping Halo stuff. That kind of shit that just happened there doesn't happen all the time. That... That shit's kind of unusual. See ya. See ya, homie. You're not trying out for phase today. I'm really tired of that joke. Can that joke die? Like, when I think of phase, I think of a bunch of fucking man children wearing Pornhub hats, fucking shouting memes, and winning way too much money for playing Black Ops. That's what I think of phase. I don't think of fucking quick scopers anymore. I don't think anybody thinks of quick scopers when I think of phase anymore. See, I jolt when I fire in this game because I'm just not. I have nerves of butter. Oh shit, you fucking... Oh, you got a fucking shotgun? Really? Get no scoped. <laughs> no, she's not gonna get no scoped. She's gonna fucking destroy me. I'm gonna lower my chair a little bit. I just realized my chair was high up for something else. I don't know why I had it so high up earlier. I just realized, like, I feel kind of awkward up here. I'm a little high up. I feel like a giant. Oh, get... Macaroni, pepperoni. Yeah, I like to do the sniping in Call of Duty. Watch me fucking quickscope the next fucking unlucky bastard that I see. What I mean by that is watch me pull out my pistol and be a smart player and actually win a gunfight. Are you? Oh, I actually quickscoped the, the the next person I saw inadvertently. I wish there was aim assist on snipers. I mean, maybe I sound like a pleb saying about aim assist. If you're a PC player, you're laughing right now. And that's fine. You're entitled to that. But at the same time, game developers acting as if, like, like analog stick dead zones don't exist is, is ridiculous to me. There's still a dead zone. So, like, doing the little last-minute adjustments like that. In other COD games, it felt coherent and smooth. Maybe even too easy at times, but now it doesn't feel good at all. And, okay, how is that guy still over there? Like, my teammates could have fucking picked him up. Look at the score. This is what happens when I snipe. I'm still leading, by the way. This is the people I get fucking usually paired up with. <laughs> okay, I have to pull out a red gun if we want to get more than 10 kills. Look at this shit. This is the shit that happens when I fucking try to snipe and just goof around. We get fucking creamed. Whoa. Oh, he already knew I was coming. I thought he just, like, reacted that quickly. Like, that's impressive. That's just, like, a... <laughs> Scaredy move. Oh, let's, let's pull this out. What's your fucking shotgun gonna do now? Nothing, because it fucking missed horribly. Yeah. I just heard someone fucking throw a fucking mine down. Oh god. And that's when we take a breath and regroup and then we go for it. You look like a fucking idiot with the fucking outfit you have on there. I don't like when people complain about Call of Duty having like brightly colored outfits and stuff. It's like... It's a... Whoa, 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 what's going on? What the fuck is going on? Where was her fucking hitbox? 
Where was the fucking aim assist pull? Where was the thing that I've been having this whole time except when I started to shoot her? Weird inconsistent crap that- Again, where's the fucking- Oh my god. It feels like it just turns off my aim assist sometimes. I, I swear to Christ. I- And I saw- I talk about aim assist a lot. Maybe it sounds like I rely on it too much. But you can tell. Like, if you're a console player, you can maybe vouch for this. You can tell when, like, it's just been taken away. Or it feels like it's been taken away. But about people in, like, brightly colored outfits, it's like, why is that a big deal, for one? It's just kind of like a... It's, you can just play the game of spot the idiot. Or you can argue that it's just good fun. Like, who cares if someone wants to look like an idiot in a first-person shooter? Who cares? Are you really trying to be that immersed in combat? Like, is that really what makes Call of Duty so cool to you, is when it feels like real war? Feels like real gritty war. I mean, fucking, I've never played Call of Duty for gritty war. Fucking played it because I like the way it feels. And so let's see if I can let's see if I can demonstrate why I like Call of Duty. Like right here, right now. That, that shit. That's just that. It's snappy. It's coherent. It's up there shooting me in the back. It's. I was. That was dumb of me. I should have checked up there because I did see someone. I see. I saw a little pulse on the map. Let's see if I can flank him. If he's still up here. I bet he is. I bet he is, too. I hear jumping around. You're fucking dead, man. Let's see if I can get a long shot. Hopefully that HCXD doesn't kill me. Oh, I actually destroyed it. Cool. I want to get, like, a long shot, like, cross map kind of thing going on, but I don't think that's going to happen. Oh. Someone's going to land right here. Oh, that's way too long of a range. What the fuck's wrong with me? Oh. I just, the word, like, scumpy comes to mind. If you guys, fucking optic scumper. I remember back in, like, when, when I actually thought he was cool. Um, I don't like his opinions anymore. I don't like his point of view on Call of Duty. Um, I can make a whole video on why I think scumper is a little bit annoying. Um. Oh, I missed that last shot. I saw it whiz past his leg. Fuck me. But no, like, I just, every time I do something like that, I remember, like, when he was really cool. Um, that was dumb. Uh, when it, when he was cool, I remember he did that awesome play in Black Ops 2, and he started screaming, Who's the best in the game? And I thought, like, what a fucking badass dude. It was, like, so inspirational to me as, like, a really, like, as a COD noob, as someone that does that all the time. I'm like, oh, you know, that's so cool that someone can be that confident. Oh my god, you fucking activate your reactive armor right there. You're on my shit list, dude. Like, you don't even know. My shit list is a fucking word long, and it's just your gamer tag. Fucking nice jump, but you fucking failed miserably. That's someone with a fucking scuff controller. That's the guy that jump shot me in the window earlier. They make such a fucking fool out of themselves sometimes jumping like that. Not me, though. I fucking use a standard controller. It reminds me not to bounce around like a fucking pleb. Look at these kids with their scuffs. Bouncing into my bullets. How did that not hit her? Is the question I would be asking right now. Uh, I was hoping that grenade would do something fun. Whoa, something, something was hitting me. I have no idea what. I didn't see anyone on my screen, and then the person popped in the window after I died, so that was kind of strange. Maybe I was getting wallbanged by something. Either way, guys, that was a little bit more of a rough match, but I still had fun. I still had some good, some good moments, some fun times. You can tell, though, like, this is not an over-exaggeration. Look at the fucking people I get paired up with. On, like, a, on a daily uh, Black Ops 3 playing basis, if I play this game at all, this is what I get 9 times out of 10. Ooh, look at him. He's fucking dancing his shit. Fucking, he's got tinfoil on his head and he's dancing. He doesn't give a fuck. That's the guy who's jumping around with the fucking scuff controller. Like, doing all the jump shots and walking into my bullets. Good shit. 